We learned that the show was coming to an end probably halfway through the third season. And we didn't concretely find out that it would be guaranteed our final season until like 24 hours before it was announced. But we all knew, we were reading the scripts, it was clearly a series ending, and I think that I was able to give myself a lot of closure leaving that said, and, and I went through all of the stages of grief and all of the all of the feelings, and it felt a bit tough because it felt like we were taking it away from Indian country. But there's something about going out guns a-blazing that where it's just as strong, if not stronger, than the first season that shows don't always get to do, and that I'm able to feel really proud of. Ah! Knowledge bomb! The red stock band is every turn! Did I get my records? Records? I'm thinking about going to school. In terms of representation of indigenous folks in the media, that things are beginning to improve. The reason for that being is because there are a lot of indigenous writers and creators and filmmakers behind the camera. And I think that's ultimately where representation needs to come from. I'm a believer of if a project is created and is birthed by an indigenous creative or by a queer creator or by somebody from a specific movie, then that movie is inherently indigenous or queer or whatnot. So we're beginning to see more indigenous characters on film and TV in the mainstream media. We're starting, starting to get more access into these spaces, but I feel like it's, it has to just be the beginning because there's still, for example, on Res Dogs, we are like, oh, this is the native show, but it's representative of a Muscogee and Seminole community in rural Oklahoma. It's not my nation, it's not any nation of basically any of the other cast members. So the fact that we're expected to be representative of all indigenous people is just not something that is possible or can exist. And so I think our show and our projects might not be everybody's cup of tea and it shouldn't be. And there should be more different types of tea out there for people to try and, and be into by indigenous creators.